Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to the Graveyard. I'm Thorny Undead and this is my review series where I talk about movies, TV, video games, music, not necessarily in that order. So I checked out this Netflix series, Altered Carbon, and it actually ended up being a lot more awesome than I expected. Now we got some minor spoilers ahead, but most of what I'm talking about takes place in the first episode and I'm not gonna give away the ending or anything like that. Now Altered Carbon takes place in like the distant future and humans have sort of become immortal. Uh, bodies aren't important, they refer to them as sleeves. Like here, this clip kind of explains the core of what's going on in this show. This is a cortical stack. As protectorate citizens, we each have one implanted when we are one year old. Inside is pure human mind coded and stored as DHF, digital human freight. Your consciousness can be downloaded into any stack in any sleeve. You can even needle cast in minutes to a sleeve anywhere in the settled worlds. A sleeve is replaceable, but if your stack is destroyed, you die. There is no coming back from real death. I know, weird, right? So this is like the core concept they use to build the show, and what's weird about it is you don't really know who's who all the time, because the identity of a character isn't tied to who you're looking at. It's kind of like Mystique from the X-Men, where everybody had to play that character if she was imitating them, and I'm willing to bet it put an extra burden on the actors, but they pull it off pretty well, and mad props to them all around. So our story follows Takashi Kovach. He's an envoy, which is complicated. It would probably take this whole review to explain what that is, but let's just say he's special and very capable. So he's hired by this guy, Lawrence, to solve his own murder, and that's kind of our overarching season plot that, that takes us through the story. So Takeshi reluctantly takes this job and sets off solving this mystery. So I'm not going to go into too much more detail about the plot, to be honest, because I'll be here all day filming it. So I really just want to talk about what I like about the show and why I recommend it. So first off, they built a really awesome world, and it's, you know, distant future, space age, I love that, and it's a very dark, like, noir feel to it, and I think that's probably one of the things that really attracted me to this series. Now, the show is very character-focused. You never really get it pulled back and see the big picture of what's going on. You get a taste of the politics, and you get a backstory of where you are, but they really spend the majority of the time developing the characters and staying zoomed in on their story. And truthfully, it doesn't really matter anyway, because you become so invested with these characters and what's going on between them that the details kind of fall to the wayside, and a lot of it is open for interpretation, which is another thing I really like about the show. Now, I really could go on and on. This show is fantastic, and there's a lot going on. Uh, I recommend watching it with subtitles on, and I had to watch it twice even because it's a ve it's very dense. I'd say it's tough to get through the first two episodes. There's a lot of exposition, a lot of world building, a lot of character introduction, but it's completely worth it if you can get through it. By mid-season, they really do have you hooked, and they keep you guessing, and I know I ended up binge-watching the last couple of episodes because I had to know what happened. So yeah, Altered Carbon is an awesome show. I absolutely recommend it. I hope you check it out. If you do, let me know what you think in the comments down below, or you can stop by my Twitch stream and talk about it. I'm live six nights a week, usually starting about 7 p.m. Eastern Time, and I'll leave a link to it down below. And until next time, good luck, have fun, good game.